hi in this video i am going to show how you can create a whatsapp traffic campaign from facebook ads manager just open your facebook ads manager normally we are creating campaign from the creator but for this campaign i am going to create an audience first once we start creating a campaign you will know why we creating this audience on your ads manager left panel side on the tools area you will you can get the audience tab click on audience tab then you can find create audience tab here just click on create audience then you can click this saved audience option you will get a pop up window to create a saved audience here you can target your location where you want to show your location for your ad you can search your location by country wise city wise from here then you can set up the age group i'm going to set here 18 to 40 here i'm going to target women because i'm going to target in my campaign that ad is related to women clothing and fashion here in detail targeting you can target your audience I select clothing you can search from here or you can go for the browse option then you can get here the audience demographic interest behavior you can click and you can go for the audience one by one you can check and which is related to your product or service you can target that audience so here I select interest who is interested online shopping you can add multiple audience for targeting then you can give audience name depending on your selection you can give audience name here i give a shopping and uh, i target in india you can give any name for your audience here i given shopping india 18 to 40 female so which i selected the setting here depending on that i put the name for the audience once you did the setup here you can click the create saved audience option to create this audience so the audience is already created and it's ready now we need to go back to the campaign creation window you can click here on the campaigns option on the left panel now i am going to create a campaign press the create tab campaign objective you can choose traffic then continue here campaign name you can give any name you can scroll down you can click next button to continue add set name you can give same as the campaign name then scroll down make sure messaging app is selected then scroll down here you can deselect the messenger and instagram option and select the whatsapp option and you can see automatically the whatsapp number will come from the facebook page then scroll down you can add your daily budget or uh, lifetime budget here then start date and end date you can set from here scroll down here you can use the switch to original audience option to target the audience and the location location option you can target location from here but we have already created the audience that we can use to use that created audience you can see here use saved audience this is the one we created now shopping audience i am going to click so now we don't need to do any setup for the location or detail targeting because automatically the audience will added here and we already selected the location gender and detail targeting before scroll down uh, the placement you can use the manual placement option here i'm going to off the instagram placement and the audience network also so i am going to target in this ad set only facebook placement later we will do another ad set in same campaign for instagram that i will show how to do that here you can see the placement facebook feed uh, we need to check here this uh, image ratio uh, we need to put square image one is to one ratio image for this placement uh, we need to make sure that 
you have already that image i already created this image in same dimension marketplace also same one is to one and facebook feed also video feed also one is to one square image now reels and stories are different so i'm going to off this and also search result i will off now so i selected for facebook facebook feed and facebook marketplace facebook video feed so three placement i selected with the same dimension for the square image okay now i'm going to click next button to continue so this is the ad level i am going to give a same name for the ad then i will scroll down and here create ad option we can add our media i am going to add image here so i already have this 1080 by 1080 pixel image it's a one is to one ratio it's already suitable for the placement which we selected i'm going to click next button to continue done now the image already loaded here and you can see the placement facebook feed facebook marketplace it's already fit that image and uh, facebook video feed also it's okay i added just a sample image here when you are creating the campaign you need to add the proper attractive image for your campaign and now you can see here uh, the call to action is whatsapp message so people can directly click on whatsapp and also you can add a primary text if you want or description per primary text you can add it here if you add a text here it will appear on your ad you can see here i'm going to delete the primary text and also you can add a description here and chat with, uh, with us uh, and here you can see headline chat with us that you can see here if you want to change this to like a contact with us or something like that you can change it from here and if you want to add a description you can add it here so it will appear here and uh, one more thing i forget uh, to add uh, here on the ad set name i will add one more extra name here fb for facebook campaign name i will keep same ad set name i will add fb and also ad name i will add fb because we will create a ad set for instagram later so now uh, this is ad level already done so i am going to publish this campaign okay i already published the campaign i am going to close this window now i'll go to the ad set level refresh Okay, I'm going to off this ad set for now. Okay, so this is the campaign which we created now. I will go to the ad set. This is the ad set and this is the ad. And this ad will show on Facebook placement. Okay, now I will go to the ad set level and I will select this ad set. And I'm going to click this drop down button then copy i'm going to copy this ad set and add so copy button then i'm going to click again this drop down and paste so there is duplicating the ad set now we can see this is the campaign and this is the ad set the first ad set this is the first ad mm -hmm. and now here you can see this is the copied one ad set and ad this is the copy so now what we are going to do here in new ad set I will scroll down this is all okay with this settings and number also same and location targeting start date end date everything will be same uh, audience also same but the placement I'm going to own the Instagram before we off this one on then Facebook I am going to off okay now Instagram is on now you can see Instagram feed placement it is uh, one is to one ratio same square image instagram profile feed also same instagram explore also same one is to one so i keep this three and instagram reels and stories is different dimension 
So I will off this one. Okay, other all placements I off already. Now three placements is on, which is related to our image size. Okay, now one more thing I will change it from here. That is the name. This is not Facebook placement. This is Instagram. So I'll give IG. So I will go to the next ad level. So ad level also I will change the name here. Instagram. Now here we need to double check the ad is okay or no. So everything is perfect because the image size is same. And uh, there is already send message button. If someone click from Instagram your ad, uh, the send message button automatically they can send the message to your WhatsApp business WhatsApp. So I'm going to publish this new ad set. Okay, I'm going to close this. Now I'll go back to the ad set. I will refresh. Okay, now you can see this is the first ad set this is the second one this ad set is for facebook and this ad set is for instagram if i go to the ad level you can see two placement this is for facebook preview facebook feed and uh, marketplace and uh, video feed placement and this one is instagram placement preview you can see it will show in the instagram this ad we'll go back to the ad set now we can see here uh, what is the advantage using this two ad set for different placement? Uh, you can put different amount for your budget. Facebook you can put different. Instagram you can put different budget. And you can also test from here which platform is better performing. Sometime maybe you will get more result from Facebook. Instagram you are not getting any result but you are paying money if you notify that in future you can off the Instagram and you can keep run the Facebook ad or maybe Facebook is not giving the good result and Instagram is getting more result so you can ident identify from here doing this testing but if you create a campaign with this one ad set Instagram and Facebook with the same ad set if you're doing then you, it's difficult to understand which one is performing well now with this is very clear that you can find out from here which is better performing and also you can control the budget for each ad set i hope this video is useful for you thanks for watching see you on next video